Hi, my name is Coco with BlackDom.com, and I'm here with Antonio Campos and Maggie Cohn, showrunners and executive producers of the HBO miniseries, The Staircase. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank, Thank you, you for having, having us. us. Thank you. How did you even arrive at knowing you wanted to tell this story specifically and in a miniseries type of format? Uh, it just felt like it, it felt like there was so much more to the story from the very beginning than could ever fit into the documentary. And we just really saw a way of telling this story, um, telling a true crime story that hadn't been told before and exploring, really exploring the idea of truth in a, you know, what mm -hmm. is the, what is truth um, in this genre? Mm -hmm. And especially with, with respect to what you just said, I mean, as we start to just become more engrossed in Michael Peterson's world, it's just very difficult to arrive at what truth is. And that's something that I really just, every single episode just takes you through a roller coaster of emotions. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, totally. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. I mean, I think the genres, typically the goal is to solve something or to answer a question. And I think what we're hoping to do is make people comfortable with the idea that there is no single truth. Um, and that it's your perspective and bias and your backstory that you bring to an experience that kind of shapes and forms it. Mm -hmm. So what was the delicate balance of meeting with people who were reliving this experience um, that you were actually documenting and talking about in this um, format, but also structurally telling the story um, that you knew would honor them? I mean, because there's, there, it's based on a true story. So how do you do it without offending or just pushing too, too much? hope that you know by um treating every character with respect and uh and trying to um allow moments that were moments that they lived uh through to breathe and and play out the way they might have mm -hmm. that uh that um that 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 they you know that they do justice to the reality uh, uh the, the real experience, but you know, at the end of the day, we're doing something that's inspired by a true story, and yeah. we can't, you know, we we can't uh, necessarily just recreate the truth. Um, there is a documentary for that. What we're trying to do is capture the essence of uh, of events and the essence of who these people are and were, and um, and uh, and tell our version of the story. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And it was such a great opportunity to bring, you know, to fully realize Kathleen Parrott Peterson as a woman and as a character, um, which we hadn't really seen before. Um, I, I agree with that. I, I really liked the way that you really um, just made her like just human and whole, you know, and yeah. that's something that, yeah, you, you just weren't. And yeah. great and dynamic and, mm -hmm. and, and a lot of that anyone else. And a lot of that is the small moments, you know, like we were, you know, there, it's not everything had to be some big, um, you know, big dramatic event. I mean, a lot of it was just like sitting with her in bed before the alarm went off or, mm -hmm. um, you know, just driving in a car with her and seeing how uh, her day might play out before she got to work. And, you know, it was those, I think a lot of the, the things that make the story richer are actually a lot of small things that happen, not these big traumatic uh, mm -hmm. brain Just points. relatable. Mm -hmm. yeah. I, I, I agree with that fully, I do. Um, once again, my name is Coco with BlackDom.com and I'm here with Antonio Campos and Maggie Cohn, showrunners and executive producers of the HBO series, The Staircase. Thank you so much guys for what you've oh, done wow. with, this, with this piece. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. It was really, really, really beautiful. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thanks. Mm -hmm. If you want to see more content like this on blackfilm.com, make sure you like, subscribe, and ring that bell.